Let's get it, let's get it. And I'm Jumpman Jax today with the Lace Swap. And we're gonna talk about him today, man, all right? Because that brown, I like how it's pulling. So you already know, hit that like button one time for the culture and subscribe if you are new to the channel. Now, with the Jumpman Jax, kind of got some versatility. You can go with the lighter colors to pull out, you know, some of that sail in them, or you go with the darker look, and ultimately, that's what I was going with today, specifically because of the lace swap. So, black tee up top definitely pulls it, gives that darker look, but then from there, we transition down because it is a nice day. We're not in the Nike shorts, no, no, no. We're going with a little fear of God right here, the little muted brown, shout out. But as you can see, I'm trying to get that darker vibe going on with it, all right? Still got the flexibility if I wanted to go with the white tee. But like I said, for what I'm trying to get off, this is the vibe. Now, let's get to what we came to see. And that is the Jumpman Jacks with the dark brown mocha lace swap. Definitely digging how that brown pops a lot more now. And as you can see with the contrast, when we talk about having that black t-shirt up top, how with the darker colors, it just flows perfectly. Now for me, I kept the, the low boy black socks on, but obviously man, to each their own with that. But I was kind of back and forth with if I wanted to have my strap on the shoe, buttoned up, or who was gonna let them hang a little bit. So I figured, you know, we switch it out today. But that dark brown, Matching the tongue obviously keeps the shoe with the more of a darker style on it. And when you talk about the black tee up top, goes perfect in terms of getting that brown to really pop. And obviously with the muted brown shorts. So you see what the vibe is today. You know I can't wait to keep wearing these things. So uh, 